Tonight we're going to do my first G1 review of Top Spin and Twin Twist. I had these figures when I was little, and I think I had one of them. I know I had Top or Twin Twist when I was little, and I love these guys. So when I found them, generally you can find these guys for like five bucks still. Uh, they might be broken. They might. Uh, be, they're definitely going to be missing their weapons, uh, like Top Spin here is missing one of the little toe wheels. Oop. Neither of them have weapons. They're both pretty dirty, but they still actually work. Even even the uh, the gimmick, I think, still works, but we'll find out in a minute. So, you know, you don't get any articulation with these guys. They, their arms move. Their head don't move. They, they, they can bow. They can, they can sit, except the springs are actually still really good, so they can... They can flip. Well, they don't even flip. They just go extra lay down. No, lay down. Okay. So, you guys are pretty cool. So, if you look at them, uh, again, these are like original originals, and I haven't replaced the stickers. So, you get to look at the face on that guy. The backs are pretty lame. Uh, you see, these are Takara 1980, 1984, Taiwan. Uh, and this one is. Kara, 1980, 1984, Taiwan. So these are original ones. Again, it's, these aren't hard to find. You can pretty much find these at any place that sells. Uh, any kind of like collectible toy places will end up having these somewhere. They'll probably be cleaner than these. These are the exact way I bought them. Um, again, I think I paid five bucks a piece for them. And I've never cleaned them because I'm a little afraid to. Um, I might see if Toy Hacks has labels for them. I'm sure they do. Because some of the labels are messed up anyway. But you, know, you still get the... So they have this exact same articulation. They're almost the exact same robot. Um, but they're not quite, because there's no similar parts. So for size comparison on these guys, I brought out some stuff I never actually removed from the case, but I thought it was fitting. So we have G1 Blue Streak. G1 Jetfire. And we'll use the Walgreens Earthrise Red Alert. There is your scale. So now I'm going to show you how to transform these guys. So first, no, pay attention. This gets really complicated. You lay him down on his back. And you're done. You lay him down on his back. And you're done. So Twin Twist here is like a, a it, it's a drill tank, which is a, just a oddly popular, I don't know if it's just an anime thing, or a cartoon thing, or just a sci-fi thing of having big drill tanks that couldn't actually drill their way through anything because the drills aren't nearly as big as the rest of the robot. But you see he's got really cool details. Look at the sides of where the treads would be. The back's really goofy and plain. Nice chrome double drills uh, see the sides the other one turns into this I, I think it's an airplane like a little just like a little flight thing I don't know um, instead of having the drills it has these uh, here's the wings he's got weapons on this on his fists uh, if you turn them around you can kind of see where that would be his jets now whoever stuck the stickers on this thing 20, 30 years ago, 30 years ago now, uh, they put these down here, and I don't know why they didn't put them up there, or they got moved somewhere along the lines. Um, so now I'm going to try this. I don't know if this is still going to work. I was trying to get this working off camera. So the way these work, you pull them back. Hold on. I might have the... So the problem is, you can't, like, you can't transform them. They don't have a release button that I can remember. So you're, you're kind of stuck. But they do have this little knob on the back of their head. You see that. Ah, oh, there he goes. Let me see if I can get it to work better. 
see if we can. No, no, come on. No, he's not gonna work. Come on, bro. You can do it. Do it for your fans, man. Do it for your fans. All right, he's not gonna do it. Uh, see if the other one will do it. He still works. Wait. Continue to the other side. He won't pop. Maybe I got the head thing switched the wrong way again. But there, there, there's a little knob on the back of his head that's supposed to do something, and I can't remember exactly what it does. Come on! Okay, let me clip it the other way. I know there's a reason for this knob on the back of his head, and I can't remember if one of it makes him so he doesn't transform, and the other one makes it so he does, or if there's something like that. I can't remember. I mean, he works pretty well. He just... There he goes. Anyway, they're supposed to kind of... That flip... They don't... I don't remember if they'll actually, like, flip and stand up. But they flip, and that's how they work. Now, given... Th they worked... In the 80s. So, 40 years ago. Just shy. These were fine. They worked. They did what they were supposed to do. They even came with weapons. Uh, they, even, they even came with rub signs. I don't know if this still works. It actually kind of still works. Kind of. Yeah, there we go. Look. This rub sign still kind of works. So that's G1 Top Spin and Twin Twist. Contrary to popular belief, a warm fart is not warmer than these guys. These guys are just that cool. If you liked the video, don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe. Uh, YouTube, YouTube, YouTube. Um, we're still leading up into TFCon, so uh, there should be a link below for the uh, information about the uh, giveaway I'm doing. If I see a TFCon wearing one of my shirts, I've got some custom-made rollers that I'm going to give out that will only be made once. I've also uh, started putting my 3D prints up on Etsy, so if you're interested, there'll be an Etsy link too. Thank you and good night!